locations department. What is it? How do you join? And why would you want to join? Today's been a little interesting. Driving around location scouting again and trying to lock in the last couple few things and realistically just get a few more options. And it's not been as easy as I'd like or as thoroughly done as I would like, but we are against the timeline and that's what happens. So I don't feel like I adequately explained location scouting and locations department yesterday because it was just kind of haphazardly thrown together. So part of location scouting is literally being the stand-in and walking through the scenes for the director and the DP to like actually look at. So that's what Leo and I just did. We just walked that scene. So I'm gonna go check in with him. Well, locations is really the kind of backbone of film work in a sense. It's where you're shooting, where, you know, in a city, in a town, whatever. It's finding all the buildings, the streets, Um, so we're the guys that kind of set all that up and realistically it's a hard job it's not one that a lot of people can do um, because it does take a very fine knowledge of the area it takes uh, personal skills um, to deal with people and it takes a lot of hard work and a lot of foot pounding and knowledge of the streets um, and that just sounds really weird but it's true it's knowing anybody and everybody of how to find out who owns a property or a building or a business and then how to work with them. So understanding what days businesses or bars or restaurants are busy, what times roads are busy so that you can move through and things around. You know, it's, it's a little crazy. It's all inclusive. There's all kinds of things to know. You always got to keep your head on straight. And the other thing is, is you're constantly fixing problems that the rest of the departments create. You're constantly working with keeping the city and the local people together. So I'm going to duck into Best Buy real quick and then we'll take part two of this conversation. I love it, Kyle, getting all the coverage. That's gonna look cool. So going back to the locations, the locations department, like I said, is the one who finds everything where we film, gets all those wonderful landscape shots and figures all that stuff out. We don't actually be the ones to shoot it, but we do go and find it. So we're the guys constantly out there pounding the pavement, looking. We know where all the best spots are, which helps us get to know every business owner, restaurant, bar, store, hotel, uh, private homes. You know, we're the guys that know all those people which is phenomenal when you need something because you can really just roll through your phone or for us older people, a Rolodex, and just be able to pull up that number and be able to call people. But it also means you have close connections with the police, the fire, um, ATF, FBI, any of those guys in town for when, let's say we're doing a car wreck or an explosion scene or staging a bank robbery. We have to call all those people and let them know what's going on. So having those kind of relationships is amazing. And it really pays off in the long run. Plus, you get to see some really cool houses, some really cool office locations. And you just get to walk up to buildings when you have a project and go, huh, I wonder what's in there. Well, let me go knock on the door and find out. And sometimes, yeah, people say, no, I'm not interested. And that's okay. Because then you go on to the next location. You go find another one. So that's locations in a nutshell. And there's so much more to it that you deal with. And it's a lot of headaches and a lot of burnout. And a lot of stress and a lot of time away from home but I honestly wouldn't trade it for a lot of things in the world and it's a one of the best departments I've ever worked in and one I truly enjoy so if you ever want to know more leave a comment below and I'll answer your questions all right thanks for watching like and subscribe below and we'll see you later or as I say see you on the next one <laughs> all right.